everyone and welcome back to Thomas and Friends Home Media Reviews. This time around it's a supplemental on James Learns a Lesson on VHS. I don't believe we've done a supplemental to, to this episode. We might have, now that I think about it. No, I'm thinking back to when we did the whole Thomas and his Friends Help Out slash James Learns a Lesson supplemental episode last year. Which, now that I think about it, might also be a James Learns a Lesson. No, 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 that was a point two. Never mind, that was not a James Learns a Lesson supplemental. Even though we did look at the 1995 sticker label version of James Learns a Lesson in that supplemental that was mainly based on Thomas' and Friends Help Out. However, this time it's only on James Learns a Lesson on VHS. And this time around, we actually have a bit of a rarer version to look at. You may recall in the original James Learns a Lesson HMR, we took a look at this version. This is the second 1990 version of James Learns a Lesson, right? You know, this is what we saw back in, back in the early days of HMR. You know, the red tape, very rare, very rare version. But you can see over here on the right side of the screen, I have recently acquired the first VHS version of James Learns a Lesson, also from 1990. So let's take a look at it here. As you can see, it's a completely different screenshot. How, however, the tape layouts are identical. It's the identical shade of red as well, if you can tell. It's just the screenshots that are changed. This is, I believe it's a screenshot from Old Iron, I think is what it looks like. And then this is from Edward Helps Out, I think. It might have been a zoomed in image from Edward Helps Out. I'm not sure, but that's what it looks like to me. The screenshot is pretty much the only change. The sides are exactly the same. James Learns a Lesson Strand VCI. The backs are also the exact same, featuring the same screenshot from Henry Special Cole, which is actually a deleted scene from that episode. So yeah, exact same screenshots. Believe the blurbs are the same. I don't take time out of my day to read those. Story stops, exactly the same. Everything is exactly the same. It's just that the front screenshots are different. If you noticed earlier, like with this James Learns a Lesson, red tape. But if you take a look at this version, sorry, it kind of gets stuck in there. It's a blue tape. It even has its barcode down there from its original release. So yeah, blue tape. You guys might be thinking to yourself, whoa man, I didn't know that blue tapes were a thing before uh, Thomas and the Magic Railroad came out. Because if you know, blue tapes were used to promote Thomas and the Magic Railroad. However, you would actually be wrong, because the first release of James Learns a Lesson had a blue tape, obviously, as you can tell. I think the first release of Thomas Gets Tricked also had a blue tape. I personally have never seen one. If any of you guys have one, you know, tweet it at me and show me to prove that it exists, because I've never seen one. I didn't even know that a blue copy of James Learns a Lesson um, existed until about a year ago when I saw... Um, a user who I can't remember the name of did an unboxing video on it, I believe. Or maybe it was like a Goodwill Pickups video or something, but he was like, yo, man, look at this, look at this rare James Learns a Lesson blue tape. And I was like, whoa, I did not know that existed. I can't remember the user's name off the top of my head. If I did, I would shout him out here, but I'm sorry, dude, I, I can't remember your name. <laughs> so you all might be wondering, Lego lover, how exactly did you come to acquire this super rare version of James Learns a Lesson from 1990? Well, let's go ahead and say this first off. The, this version of James Learns a Lesson really is not that rare per se. There's actually a lot of people out there that have this version. And there's a lot of people out there that have this version as well. It seems that red and blue tapes of James Learns a Lesson are extremely common for the most part. However, red Thomas gets tricked, uh, red tenders and turntables, anything red after James Learns a Lesson is not easy to find. And also a blue Thomas gets tricked. I don't know if that exists. So that's probably hard to find as well. Actually, it's a funny story on how I found it. I was actually looking for a 1992 print of James Learns a Lesson. That's the only print of James Learns a Lesson I don't have from the 90s. So I just looked up on eBay, James Learns a Lesson VHS, and lo and behold, the second, was either the second or third option was this right here. It was $9.99 with fast and free shipping, and of course, I looked at it, I studied the photos, I pounced on it within the first five minutes of finding it, because there was no way I was letting this slip through my fingers. So anyway, guys, that's pretty much it for this supplemental. I have not tried to play this VHS in my VCR, because I don't want to risk damaging it. 
I already know that this one does not play as well as it used to, so I'm not risking this or this. This will probably never get played by me, never be watched by me, so I don't know what the picture quality is. It probably stinks because, you know, it's a 1990 print. So that pretty much does it for this supplemental on James Learns a Lesson. If I do end up getting a 1992 print, which, let's be honest, I more than likely will at some point, I will do a supplemental on that. It'll probably be a James Learns a Lesson point two at some point. So it's a bit of a shorter one this time around, but, you know, this is the first supplemental of 2018, so a good track record, I guess. Last year I was doing supplementals week after week after week. Here's to not as many supplementals for HMR 2018, guys. Thank you all for watching, and as always, good night, everybody.